Hi, my goodness, what a rainy weekend and a great day today. Yes, uh, today we're a little bit more dry, but don't worry, there's more rain to come. Uh, so far, we're doing pretty well for the month of June, but you got to remember since the beginning, since October 1st of our wet season, we're still behind by almost nine inches of rain. So let's see how the rest of June plays out. Well, at least the rest of this week. We have several systems kind of lined up here in the Pacific. We'll be tapping into some of them, giving us more rain. And by the end of the week, we could be looking at rain totals closer to about another inch on top of what we've already had so far. Current conditions, yeah, mostly cloudy now in Portland. It's 62. Wind is out of the east at five miles per hour. Sunset time, 858. Now over to Kalama, much darker looking out there. And we have showers on the way 63 in Kalama. So these temperatures are well below normal for this time of year. What is normal for Portland? It would be about 71 degrees for your daytime high. So tomorrow waking up to showers, the heaviest rain expected even before 8 o'clock in the morning. A temperature right around 54. We get to your noon hour 59. And then by the time we reach 3 o'clock in the afternoon, still showers on and off. Low 60s for you. Wind mostly coming out of the south at about 10 miles per hour through 7 o'clock. Showers continue, a temperature of 63 by then. So let's talk about timing for the wet weather tonight. Let's focus right around Portland and Vancouver. This takes us to 6 o'clock, noticing any chance of rain is going to be pretty limited, just a few isolated sprinkles remaining overcast. Salem South, though, that's where you're looking at the rain kind of popping up. Now notice offshore what's happening. We get to about 10 o'clock. Now the widespread rain begins. This is 10 o'clock tonight. You can see all the way out towards Mount Hood and now entering Central Oregon, Madras and Bend. Now everybody gets a chance to see some rain overnight through four o'clock in the morning, including Eastern Oregon, Central Oregon. Now most of the valley for the moment, about four or five o'clock in the morning, might get a little bit of a break in between, but Portland North, it's going to be a soaker for you. Continuing through about nine o'clock, some heavier bands of rain rolling in until about 9, 10 o'clock, and that'll be basically from Salem to the north up through Longview. And then we get to tomorrow evening, noticing the heaviest and worst of it heads out to Eastern Oregon, and that'll be about 5.30 tomorrow night. By the time we roll into Wednesday morning, we see more clouds in the mix, another chance of showers, but it'll be pretty limited. So really Wednesday, Thursday will be kind of a dry period, more or less. So. How much rain could we see here as we roll on through the rest of the week? We might be able to total an additional inch of rain going all the way out to Sunday. Of course, these totals will change quite a bit. But if everything is model perfect, then it could be over an inch of rain for us in Portland from now all the way through Sunday as we're expecting more rain a little bit every single day. How about Eastern Oregon? We might be able to pick up something closer to about an inch and a half out towards Joseph Baker City, about seven tenths of an inch. Pendleton, close to eight tenths. And at the coast, biggest totals, of course, on the high end, might be up to two inches of rain between now and Sunday night. So temperature wise, we will eventually warm up by Wednesday. We're up to 76, mostly cloudy. Back to mostly cloudy for you Thursday, 73. Another chance of rain for you Friday and through the weekend where temperatures will be in the mid to low 60s. Thanks, Natasha. Still